Hello guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Before I start, you can go down there and subscribe, click the like button, you can follow me on Instagram if you want. Today I decided to film a video showing you how to edit an iMovie, but specifically to put your screen recording of your phone in iMovie and put the shape of an iPhone and not just your phone recording. And I hope it will help someone. So without further ado, let's get started. First of all, you want your like the, the video you want to use in your background. So I'll just cut it short here. Split clip. That's just one minute. Well, okay. Let's do at least. Okay, that's a two minute clips. Clip. Okay, then uh, you want to take your uh, screen recording and I'll record it right now in iMovie. So my desktop, this one, okay. I'll import this, I'll drag it on top here. So you see it's in the middle, by default it's over there, but it's there. So first step is done. Then you click on your screen recording and not the original video. So the screen recording, you go uh, to this here, that's the video overlay settings. Normally it's already open like it was. It's, by default it's at cutaway, but you want to select picture in a picture. So now, oh, it's there, really small, we'll put it a little bit bigger, about this size. So now when I play it, now it's gonna pop up on the side, well, on my side. Then the screen recording is there. So that's the first step and that's all we have to do for now. You just want to choose where you want to put it, if it's on this side, on the other side. And yeah, so it's over here. You can put like fading if you want to. But that that's not a point. You want to export this video a first time. I don't know that's the way it is with iMovie. I don't know if it's like that with other programs like Final Cut Pro or I don't know other ones but that's how you have to do it with iMovie you can't put two picture in a picture in one clip so I'll export it right now so over here in the corner file I'll call it iPhone recording recording one because I'll have another one I'll always choose better quality today is not uh, the point but and on my desktop that's just what I prefer so it shouldn't be too long um, I'll put it over here now I do have a folder called YouTube where I keep things that I want to use again and I have a iPhone PNG so I have already one that works but we can go on internet, safari, whatever. Okay, share successful. If you write iPhone, PNG, maybe I'll need that, it's good. In the past, 
I could tell if it was a real PNG by the background. So if there was squares like this, it was a real PNG. There's a lot of fake ones, I don't know why. Actually, I'll just go back to iMovie, iPhone, recording one. Because you need to start a new document, a, a whole new movie to put the, the phone in it. So import, I'll import the other ones that we just made. So it was iPhone recording one. So in this one, there's the phone, but you can't move it anymore. It's there and it's fixed. So it's part of the clip and there's nothing to do with it anymore. Going back here, you could choose whatever phone you have. Uh, I have a, an iPhone. Oh, you see this one is good. I'm pretty sure. I have an iPhone XS Max, so I can't use this. I have to use something like this. We can try this one. Uh, I'll just save image as and I can just leave the name like this and I'll save it. Then going back to iMovie, I'm gonna import this picture and we'll see if it's a real or a fake one. And actually I'm pretty sure it's a fake one because yeah, you see the squares are still here. It's too big right now. But even if I put picture in a picture, it's not transparent at all. So that's not a good one. And we'll just delete that. Um, delete. Yes, a delete. How to tell if it's a real one or a fake one on Google? Actually, I don't know. Uh, I'm sorry about it. <laughs> I really don't know. That's why I kept mine that I found. I tried multiple ones. Let's see, maybe this one here. Probably not. If it's yellow, whatever. I like yellow. My phone is gold, but yellow will do. And XR or XX Max or any X. And you see, now the background is black. I'm pretty sure that's a good sign. And it is, you see, it's clear, it's transparent, it's beautiful, it works. So I'm gonna go here, the crop section, I'm gonna put fit, I'm gonna go in this one, what's it called, a video overlay settings, like before, it's a cutaway, I'm gonna put picture in a picture, and then I'm just gonna put it here. And you just have to try and fit. And here we go. Can I put this bigger actually? Just so we can see. Here we go. So you just resize it with the size you want. And now you adjust the length of this. So it comes in at the right time and it goes on until it's stopped here. Comes in about at the same time actually. And until the end of, okay, this goes a little bit before, wow, my fans are going crazy. Okay, the contour like this, again, a little bit less. Whoa, not that much. Just have to play with it until it's... At the same... Place. One more. 
This should be good. No. Oh. Again. No. What did I do? Wow. Okay, I didn't go this the right way. We're almost there. Almost. That's pretty good. That will do. So, here we go. And then you just have to export it again. Same process here. File and export. And there you have it. You have your phone screen recording. Sorry. Um, with a beautiful shape of an iPhone in iMovie. So, I'm just gonna put this, put this. Fans are going crazy. Um, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope uh, you liked the video. I hope it helped you in any way that, well, I hope it did help you. And don't forget to subscribe down below, give the video a thumbs up. And I'll see you next time in my next video. Bye.